Hello, my name is Greg Story. I'm the president of Dale Carnegie Training here in Japan. When we have mistakes to deal with on the part of our colleagues or our subordinates, it's very easy to get into the mistake of, I'm perfect, you're imperfect. I never made a mistake in my life, look what's wrong with you. And forget, depending on their age and stage in their career, uh, they probably made less mistakes than we're the same age and stage in our careers. And we tend to somehow have eliminated all the problems we had learning on the way through our careers and expect others to be perfect from the get-go. We learn by making mistakes. We are the complete embodiment of all the errors and mistakes we've ever made because that's how we learnt. So let's not deny that of other people. And when we're being harsh on people about the mistakes they made, well, we presume we're perfect. We forget that we made the same mistakes or worse when we're their age and stage. And we also put a big separator between ourselves and the other person. Suddenly we're on a pedestal. I'm perfect, you're not. It's very hard to have a close, tight relationship, either as a colleague or boss to subordinate. So let's not do that. When mistakes come up and we need to talk about them, why don't we reference mistakes that we made? So we're not putting it in their face that they made a mistake. We talk about, yes, I remember this came up and I, I did this and it didn't go well and this is what the result was and it wasn't a good result. And we humanize. We humanize the problem. Then people who are stepping out of their comfort zone, people who are trying something new particularly, well, they feel, you know, okay, it's not just me. Uh, my boss or my colleague also made mistakes and look at that, they're still here and they're still doing well, so it's not fatal. Because this can often be the problem. Think, people think, oh, it's all over, I've blown it completely. Well, mistakes are rarely that big. But if we want people to keep going forward, we have to encourage them to keep trying, keep them motivated, keep them engaged, to keep stepping up, stepping out. So let's not talk about what they did first up. Let's talk about something that we did as a point of reference. So it's a very subtle way of saying, yes, you made a mistake. I made mistakes too, but it didn't kill my career. And we learn from these things, so let's see this as a learning opportunity, a learning chance, and keep going with what we're doing here and build our experience and keep our confidence up and keep moving forward. And if we do that, then the motivation will stay high. People will then work harder to recover from the mistake. They'll learn from the mistake in a positive way that they won't repeat the mistake. And really, that's what we want, isn't it?